So we just made an exception to the rock policy. Everybody pull on in. I want you to relax, actually. I'm sorry to keep you waiting out here. Come on in here. Make this tight. Apologize. We were flying around up there trying to find a hole in the weather, but I heard you needed a you were in need of a brigade commander, so I'm here. I'm ready to be pressed back into service. Hey, it's great to be with Task Force Mountain Warrior. When we set up this trip a couple of weeks ago, actually probably a couple of months ago, we were reading about all the great stuff you were doing out here. And you know, you sort of got a little bit of the, it's different, I know, but it's a little bit of the Anbar Awakening going out here. What you've done with the Shinwari and all that, and I don't want to overstate it, and I know it's a work in progress. And I know it's never quite as good as it looks on PowerPoint slides, but it's very significant. And what you've accomplished out here in, in Indian country, if you will, in very tough, tough period. Everybody relax, by the way. In fact, here's how we'll, everybody put your hands in your pockets. <laughs> Seriously, right up here too. You guys relax. Guys standing at attention, put your hands in your pockets. You got them. I know you've never used them before. Sorry, Major would kill you, but go ahead. See, he can't even get his hands in his pockets. <laughs> okay, now you can just sort of relax, be, do whatever you want to do. Um, so anyway, we're reading about this. And uh, by the way, I also have enormous respect for your brigade commander, for a lot of the leaders, a lot of the commissioned, non-commissioned officer leaders in your formation with whom I've been privileged to serve in recent years in various places in particular. And so I said, hey, we've got to go out there. Uh, we're going to head to Task Force Mountain Warrior, uh, going to talk to the brigade commander, talk to the key leaders and so forth. And I know he's uh, sitting on a plane trying to wait for the weather to clear as well. I'll find out why we could get in and he couldn't. There's a little, not that I'm competitive or anything like that. Uh, but I do want to get into this and I do want to find out what magic you have done uh, because it's very impressive. But we got a couple bits of business here, actually. Besides awarding medals and coins and a variety of other things here and doing a great re-enlistment or two, uh, I want to find out, I'm just curious, how many of you in the audience have more than 36 months deployed in Iraq or Afghanistan since 9-11? Wow. That is awesome. Okay. Here is the deal. I've got a coin for you. And are you the official cameraman? I'm one of them, sorry. Yes, You're, who's, the, who's your official cameraman from right here? Right there. Okay. CFC Rainey. You are the woman. Okay, here's the deal. I want you all to line up. Let's see, right over here, sorry. So you line up, if you got 36 months or more, you line up right over here. Okay, you get, where's CFC Rainey? You go right over here. I've got the coin. You hold that in your left hand. You give me your right hand. Hold that in your left hand. But you got to look at the camera and smile. Actually, even better. I'll do it in my right hand. That way I can take forever. Let's try this again. Okay, here, we'll go like that. Okay, there you go. Well done. All right. Wait, Dad, take your glasses off. Mama will not like it. <laughs> I knew there was going to be one somewhere. Hey, Dog been 
Okay, where's that narrator? Tell us what we're going to do here, big guy. Ladies and gentlemen, the commander, U.S. Army Central Command, General David H. Petraeus, to be assisted with Lieutenant Colonel Sean F. Mullen and Command Sergeant Major Charles V. Sassy Jr., Deputy Commander and Command Sergeant Major of Task Force Mountain Warrior, will present awards to 10 outstanding warriors. Attention orders. The Army Combination Medal with Valor is awarded to Staff Sergeant Christopher W. Delu, Box Company, 2nd Battalion, 12th Infantry Regiment, for exceptional valorous actions while in a combat patrol. Staff Sergeant Delu repeatedly exposed himself to intense direct enemy fire while his patrol was engaged in a complex um, ambush, ultimately putting his safety and well-being of his unit in front of his own. The Army Combination Medal with Valor is awarded to the following personnel for exceptional valor in the face of the enemy while serving as a quick reaction force in support of Task Force Destroyer. These fine soldiers bravely volunteered to go up a mountain to assist with the Kazi back of a fallen hero and several wounded soldiers while receiving heavy enemy small arms, RPG, and recoilless rifle fire. Their courage under fire, without regards to their own personal safety, led to the recovery of the fallen soldier and medevac of the wounded. Sergeant Jeremy Keel, 984th Military Police Company, 759th Military Police Battalion. Sergeant Chris Lee, 984th Military Police Company, 759th Military Police Battalion. Sergeant Kevin Michigan, 984th Military Police Company, 759th Military Police Battalion. The Army Combination Medal of the Valor is awarded to